Good morning. Is it morning? Mm, nope. Nope. It's not morning. It's the afternoon. It's afternoon now. Second job of the day. <laughs> Got a bit of a late start today. So here we are. We're set up. We are taking down this beautiful tree. It's actually one of the ugliest ones I've ever seen. Yep. It's pretty uh, ugly. Apparently the owner wants it gone because it's been scaring small children. <laughs> Fell off the ugly tree and hit every branch and went down. <laughs> I'll show you some pictures. <laughs> It's a white spruce, uh, also known as a Canadian spruce, mm -hmm. and uh, it's not a big tree. Setup's really easy, should go really well, won't take too long, but we've said that before. Yeah, we tend to <laughs> <laughs> super underestimate. Super immaculate property here, um, which, That's is, gorgeous. which is kind of nice. It's easy to clean um, when there's not like three years of leaves around and stuff. Debris. So, debris, <laughs> yeah, we can leave it nice and clean the way it was. Yeah, pretty easy access too. The, we were able to get the lift right beside the tree and the chipper right there too. And it's right off the driveway, which makes it super easy to uh, feed the chipper and stuff. You're not tripping over stuff. It's easy to rake it out of the way. Um, so yeah, really good access. Yeah, we're gonna cut it nice and low. I'm gonna be returning here to do the stump. And uh, yeah, cool. That's about it. That's about it. All right, let's get started. Enjoy. So I like to put boards down on the ground because as the legs lift, they come in and it kind of pulls the ground. Also gives a little bit better uh, stability. If uh, the ground sinks on one of these legs, the machine will um, recognize. It's got sensors in all the feet, as you can see. As soon as there's no pressure on it, it uh, puts me in down mode only. It tells me something's wrong. So uh, I'm going to double these up just because you can see here. I don't want the uh, the leg hitting the corner of the driveway. And on the uh, asphalt, it doesn't really need it. So I'm going to do that. Adventure, probably should have checked that before that. Have kids, they said. <laughs> Better warm up. Yeah. I like me a man and work here. Say what? You look great. You look great. You look professional. Let's <laughs> get this girl down. Okay. And, uh, get the next job. Yes. So, welcome to the saga of me versus the top of the tree. Now, usually I can get these big pieces in pretty good. And um, if you look at the chipper right now, there is a safety bar at the bottom. And when that's tripped, you'll see the blinking light come on right now. So that means the wheel that pulls these pieces in to get chipped stops turning. So there's no chance of this thing going in. No, and I'm completely oblivious to the fact that I tripped the safety. Oh, I did see it. There we go. You got this. All right, so attempt two, no problem. <laughs> oh, breaking this. branches as I pick I'm it up. I'm coming so down heavy. because I'm like, you know, I think she could probably use some help. And meanwhile, I'm feeling stressed because I'm like, oh no, he thinks I need help. Oh, there we go, got it again. Okay. <laughs> Getting a little frustrated <laughs> at this yep. point. But, you know, <laughs> now you know. I'm still you know, very determined. Don't trip the bar. Oh, she already tripped the bar. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to think maybe I should just stay up there now where it's safer. <laughs> But um, also afraid <laughs> if I stay up there, it's going to be worse. So I'm going to slowly come down and watch. <laughs> Assess the situation. Yeah, enjoy the show. I'm going to turn it around and see. <laughs> Throw it around a little bit. No, I don't want your help. 
Okay, I'm just I'm just gonna just just be there for moral support then. Oh, you're shaking your head like oh, I'm not my laughing goodness. at all. <laughs> this is not entertaining for me. <laughs> oh. And Let's get angry at the branches. That'll that'll still work. Still no chance of it. And I just tripped oh. it again. I don't even think I realize it. Yeah. Yep, there we go. I'm like, no, you just you okay. can stay away. No I'm, gonna... I'm over here. I'm just gonna pick up these little ones over here. <laughs> no problem. You got the big ones. And I'm like, alright, this is it. This is my chance. Okay, we got it up. It's okay. a good angle. You haven't tripped. That's perfect. You're you, almost there. You're like watching me. Yeah. I'm like I'm going to do this because I'm a strong, independent woman. It's going to go. It's I haven't tripped it yet. There, and it's starting to take. That's like a perfect angle. It's almost and... there. And no. I ran out of gas. <laughs> and that's where you're like, okay, I got this. No I... problem, babe. You did great. You, you, did great. you listened for me. And then you lined it first all up. try. Well, I got to watch you take four attempts, or was it five? <laughs> anyway. I don't know. I lost count. You showed me how to do it, so. Oh, my goodness. We're a team. Yeah, we're a team. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> it's recording. Okay. I'm this All right.
take this one. That one's too big. So what we're doing here is we're going to use the lift to load some of these pieces up. I try to keep them under the 500 pound mark, which is the uh, weight limit for the lift. Uh, I also don't use the telescopic while I'm on it, just to kind of uh, make it easier on those pads when you're at uh, near your full weight. I just kind of use the hydraulic components. And I had a previous lift like this that had a lifting hook on it. The machine is more than capable of doing it. I just try to keep it, uh, keep the weight low and the only reason we're doing it like this and not using the tractor is because this is a little bit too far to bring the tractor down. So um, yeah, keep these pieces not too heavy, load them up like this and we can still keep them for something useful for the future. Otherwise, we'd have to cut them up so small that it'd only be good for firewood. So. Yeah. That works awesome. Yeah. I like it. Brandon's coming back to do that stump, so we're going to make a way yeah. bigger mess than that. I'm going to leave most of this, but at least it looks pretty in the area. Probably yeah, the... until you get back for the stump. Yeah. Then they're going to uh, put some new soil down here. Try to cover up some of these roots. That's also why I didn't bother putting a log under that piece that fell. Yeah. Like the hole there. Yeah, it's just going to make... Normally I wouldn't do that, but the whole thing's being redone anyway, so... Yeah. Let's talk about this hole here. Doing great, love. Thanks, honey. Don't strain yourself. <laughs> oh, you mean all the branches I chipped up wasn't <laughs> straining? I retract my comment. Thank you. <laughs> I do know how heavy they were actually. They actually were so heavy. We got like lucky with that white pine the other day. Yeah, these were, I had to take them in, in two, some of these, because they're a little big and. Maybe, were they just like full of sap? Because they felt so much heavier than like some of the really big white pine branches we took. And they uh, grow funny, like you get, like it would, it would fork off a couple times and make it a little bit difficult. Yeah. So I tried to take the, the really wide ones off to make it easier for you to chip. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to help you now. We're, we're done. <laughs> oh, that's, that's too bad. <laughs> Don't worry, we got the next job. I know. <laughs> Moving on. On to the next one. We have a maple now to take down. Maple? I can't remember. Could be a maple. I don't think it's maple. It's not a conifer anyways. It's some yeah. kind of deciduous tree. Um, it's overhanging it's, like a, uh, what are those? Like portable garage. Yeah, things. whatever you call those. And, uh, and some power lines. Yeah. It's not a real big tree, but... It would be a little bit interesting anyways. We're gonna uh, be a little bit delicate about it. Shouldn't, shouldn't take that long. Yeah. So, yeah. A little later in the afternoon. It's four o'clock in the afternoon. It should be done right around the late supper. <laughs> as usual. It's typically when we eat anyways. So, yeah. so uh, we have girls and they're in school. Well, they were in school. And uh, where we are in Ontario, they just closed all the schools down. It doesn't look like they're going to open them up again. So now we've got an issue with, since we work together, um, when we do that, when we've got girls at home and no babysitters. Yep. So we've got to work when we can have someone to watch them. we got to go as much as we can when we can, and that's just COVID, so. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty crazy times. And I also still have my outdoors channel um, to work with as well. So we're trying to do tree jobs where uh, Brandon needs me on the days that we can do that. 
Um, and then on the days where I go out and make outdoors videos, Brandon's been booking more jobs like that he can do on his own, like stump guarding and stuff. But yeah, hope you guys are enjoying this video so far. We're almost at the next job, so we'll catch you when we get there. That might be. Uh, I think if I get back, it might Yep. quarters are in here so I'm not sure what kind of shots we'll be able to get um, so just bear with me we might not be able to get too good shots but <laughs> all right time to move out time to get we say wrap this video up at home. Let's do it, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Over a beer, maybe. Yes. Okay. See you guys at home. <laughs> we got some homemade burgers. My man makes some mean homemade burger. We'll see. Nah, they'll be good. They're perfect. Whew. Oh, looks good, babe. Thanks for the burgers. Very welcome. You earned it. Okay. As you can see, we're all cleaned we're all up. Up. Cleaned also up. Cleaned up. up. Uh, we were getting pretty hungry near the end of that job. We worked till about what, 6.30? Something like that? Yeah. Yeah, it was a bit of a late. Yeah, it was both about 20 minutes apart. <laughs> yeah. I was like, I need like food raging now. hungry, right? <laughs> I'm, like, I'm fine. I can keep going. And 20 minutes later, I'm like, oh. I'm hungry now. I'm really hungry. <laughs> anyway, uh, we had a great meal. We uh, had a good day. Got two jobs done. Hit a third in the morning uh, that we had to clean up from previous. <laughs> we had... <laughs> <laughs> so the last job we did uh, the neighbor ended up keeping the wood this tiny little woman <laughs> was picking up these huge pieces and just like showing up the neighbor and they're they're out there carrying them over and it was hilarious she was, was just so a go-getter picking up these monsters and i'm like oh my god like really well dude. yeah and she's just like, oh. like no no i just want to help i got this <laughs> oh man anyway that's cute so it worked out good it saves us a trip back to pick up those pieces and we don't have to like throw them in the trailer with all the chips so good to get two jobs off the list yeah in a day and finish that other one and finish that other one pretty. yeah we had a little bit of raking to do yeah uh, just to finish up that other one this morning and then and then yeah. we got to the other two trees this afternoon. Both went really well. Yeah, no problem. No injuries, no complicated. Both were like pretty good access for the most part. Um, we did good. Yeah. Had a fun day. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we feel like, always feel, come home, we were talking about this earlier, we always come home just feeling like really accomplished and it's not like, um, you know, we both used to work in construction and it's like, you're just dying to get home and live the rest of your life. But this is, probably helps that like it's your business and we just get to work together and stuff yeah i like working um with a goal in mind like we're there to get the tree down get it cleaned up yeah get it gone and people are always very um intrigued and excited and we meet it's a it's a different place every time yeah uh, different tree every time yeah um it's Good environment to work yeah, in it's it's fun it's always changing always moving always challenges but it's rewarding so yeah yeah i guess that's pretty much it <laughs> Tired. Yeah, it's been, it's a, been long. a long day. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so yeah, like Brandon said, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, we're having a blast making these videos, so hopefully that comes through and the uh, content that we make. And yeah. I guess we'll see you guys on the next video. Yeah. Have a good one. Have a good night, guys. <laughs>